There are certain books in the Bible, because of their uh, audience, that do not come under the heading of the Pauline Epistles. And the audience of the Pauline Epistles, of course, are saved people who have received Jesus Christ. Now, what you're about to study is out of James. And we've talked to you many times about these things, about the transition from the Old Testament to the New Testament. And when James writes, there are no Pauline Epistles around. And when James writes, he doesn't write to the church. Now, the new Bibles make him write to the church. They always try to make Paul into everything that he's not in. And they will tell you that James was written to the saved Jews in the church. It isn't anything of the kind. Look at verse 1 and verse 2. Look at it. You're in James chapter 1. Look at verse 1 and verse 2. It isn't written to the body of Christ. It's not a letter to the churches. It isn't aimed at saved Jews in the body of Christ. You will find passage after passage aimed at unsaved Jews. And it's aimed and written to, quote, the twelve tribes of the children of Israel. I don't know a major Bible teacher in America that teaches that. And that's what it says. So the new Bible is knock it out and write down it's to the saved Jews. It's to the saved tribes. It's to the Christians among the Jews. No, it isn't. You'll find place some black place after aim right at an unsaved Jew. Now, this is tough. You know it's tough because old Martin Luther had such trouble with it. He used to say, James is a right scoy epistle. Someday I'm going to light my stove with James. Now, you know the old war horse didn't mean that. That's an overstatement he made. But he, the Catholic saved him so much trouble with the book that he, he sometimes wishes it wasn't written. It has so many things in it that say, you see how a man is saved by works and not by faith only. And you see how that much contradicts Romans. And there are all kinds of ways of explaining these things in James, but the truth of the matter is, as we've talked to you many, many times, the uh, Matthew, Mark, and Luke, and John, those books there are coming from the Old Testament to the New Testament. And the Paul and Epistle aimed at the body of Christ, and when you get to Hebrews, you're going right into the tribulation. It's divided it's in three sections there, and there's a gradual transition. So if you want to break your neck, you're going to break your neck in Matthew, Acts, or Hebrews. Now, when you're in James, you're just uh, beyond Hebrews. So once you get beyond Hebrews, you better watch your step. And you've got to do it in James. James is not written to the body of Christ, primarily.